everybody, welcome back to the channel, and uh, welcome back to Devil May Cry. I have been spending the last few days just wanting to play this game over again after I already did the first part. Stop it. So I recently learned that the second game is, like, different than this. Than the Resident Evil 2 style. That I feel like a lot of PlayStation 2 games were back then. And this is also my second time playing through this level. Because I originally recorded two levels in one video. So part one used to be like both mission one and two. But I ended up editing the second part out. Mainly for the fact that I did not like that section of the video. So I'm re-recording it now. And I just want to get past it. <laughs> this is pretty much just this the whole level. This level is a lot shorter than, um, first level. At least, to me, felt that way. My gun actually does something, but I'm going to die. So it doesn't matter. Unless I get, like, a health or something like that. I'm dead. There. Please just give me more green orbs. If I could buy some, I would. The gun only works if you really just don't want to get up next to the person. There's a sculpture of a female. I mean, wait, can I hear a voice? I am Alistair. The weak shall give their heart and swear their eternal loyal to me. I feel like the text goes a little too slow. And again, we get stabbed. That's a disembodied hand. That's brutal. Hey, wow, no terrace on the clothes? I can't figure out if this is just an upgraded sword that we have, or if they gave us a new one. Like, if this upgrades our sword, or if it gave us a new sword. So... Alistair gives the professor lightning speed and aerial capabilities. This area is not that big. The Grim Reaper, like devil, is depicted. Key is embedded. Should I take it? Yes. Rusty key. The key is rusted. Oh, the... Uh, do a shotgun. I'm not gonna use that. <laughs> I suck at shotgun. If you see my Doom freaking series, you would know I suck at shotgun. And I won't be playing Doom Eternal for another week or so, possibly, because I don't have the money for it. I I've been trying to make money all week, 
by doing odd jobs and some of that, and I just couldn't. Can you stop, please? I really don't like how this camera works. Where it gets stuck in one place, and then you get stuck, or whatever, but... I'm really looking forward to playing Doom Eternal, but I'm kind of in the like in the mindset where it's like all my friends are getting Animal Crossing, but I'm the only one who wants to get Doom Eternal. So, ow! There's an immense power that will not allow anyone to get closer. Before I can confront the lion, I'll need a sign. Okay, then. Oh, what's over here? It's an engraving of a lion. There's something r written. Only those who the lion has accepted can set me free. Okay. So I guess I have to come back later? Statue of an angel, the guardian of a god. Oh. Last time I played this level, um, or this mission, uh, they, they automatically got triggered when I got into the freaking, uh, what is it called? The water? I don't know what it's called, actually, now, for some reason. It looks like a bird bath, kind of. But it's a, um, fountain. That's what it is. Why can I not remember? I'm just gonna, no. I wanna jump down here. I really kind of want to do two missions per uh, episode, but I kind of want to keep these videos to like 20 minutes, if that, 15, 20 minutes. Okay, now to get to the next room. I kind of feel like I'm missing stuff every time I'm going through these levels. Because there's just like a lot of things, like in the first level, there's an area where you can put stuff down. Do I just go back to the level when I find something? Or what? Or am I even allowed to go back to the mission? I hate how much health I lose when freaking getting hit by this stuff. Come on, just give me the health. Like over here. What do I put here? There's something engraved beneath the opening. This is where the gut, uh, gilding souls, souls gather. I don't, I don't know what to put there. I'm supposed to put like a stone or something like that. Wait. Okay. Staff of judgment. Stuff that uh, staff that shines with mysterious light. And now we're back in this room. Yay! But we get to go fight something new. Because we can't go through the door.
I kind of want those scissors in real life. I have no idea if my um, guns actually do anything. I oh, think. At least they do more of like an understandable amount of damage, not like freaking almost a half my health. Door won't open. Oh. No. I need as much as I can! Yes, I will. Uh oh. <laughs> Guess we could go do another mission! Because I don't like these videos being 10 minutes. Like, just like around 10 minutes. Mission 3 Destroy of Ardor. Overcome the trial and acquire the pride of the lion. Ooh. With lightning speed, plunge a sword to an enemy. I can't afford this, but uh, throw the sword like a boomer. Wow. Become airborne and capable of performing aerial electric. Um, yes. Damage enemies with an intense spinning body attack. I need to save up. The shield will surround you the body, protecting you from the attack for a certain period. You'll also be in a devil trigger state during this period. Ooh! That's cool. Oh, so... Are yellow orbs, with, like, if I were to die, instead of getting a game over, I just have another life? Is that what yellow orbs are? Because that's what it seems like it's going to be. I'm going to save my stuff. So I want to get, like, the better upgrades for Alistair. Are we at a boss? Or something like that? Or, like... Or what? The pride of Lion is granted only to those who choose the path of Trials. Wait, what are trials, exactly? Do I have to do like a whole bunch of little uh, timed things or like little other events or missions just to be able to freaking... Wait, did it just tell me to get out? I don't know if I'm doing the right thing or not. Oh. So I guess I gotta do something in order to actually get the Pride of Lion. It states, go back to the path and thou shalt return from the abyss. With thy lion heart and thou shalt receive the Pride of Lion. Um, the symbol resembles the staff of Hermes that used in the art of alchemy. Hmm. I feel some kind of mysterious force, but I just can't quite understand yet. Am I supposed to have something? I have no idea. God, that jump scared me. Fuck. Oh, oh okay, I'm dead. <laughs> oh shit. Can I can I go the way I want to? I have to do yeah, I have a certain amount of time to do this so I don't die. Is that it? 
Now do I just get the freaking Book of the Pride of Lion or whatever? So it's a thing where uh, my life is gonna go down, and if I don't do it in time, I die. Okay. Thanks for answering that for me. Pride of Lion, a sign of strong, of uh, the strong, and allows conf confrontation with the Lion Gatekeeper. Okay. Why is Alistair freaking out? That's why. Yep. How did I know that we were going to get into a boss? I didn't know exactly, but I, I guessed. body's very awkward. Okay, so how do I fight this thing? So I'm not looking up a guide, so... Oh, it's a scor... It's a scorpion? That was like a spider of some sort. What do I do? Nope. Ow. Well, I could die very quickly in this. Yep. How do I... What do I do? I'm dead already. Do I attack its face or something? Oh, I attack its face. I'm already dead, so... This is gonna be difficult. There's no way in hell I'm gonna do it in the first few fu uh, fucking tries. But at least I know how to kill him! No! I'm trying jumping! I'm dead. Move. No. Fuck. God damn it. I'm dead. I'm gonna get a game over. Wow, dude. Fuck. I can't even see the fucking creature. And I'm dead. Game over. At least there's not much to restart. Okay. I need to save right now. No, that's not what I meant to do. Fucking hell. I just learned I have an ability that allows me to freaking, um... Go full demon. And I just wasted one of them. Not full demon, but like... Have like a power upgrade of some sort. I never tried it yet, so... Let's see if it works. Can I not... Oh, wow. Oh, can I only use it? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Fuck, dude. Holy shit! Fuck. I'm almost there! I'm no! I just died! God damn it. Let go of me! Damn it! Fuck! That's the closest they've gotten! You gotta be kidding me! Dude! 
Fuck you, camera. You're the worst of it. No, fuck. I couldn't even jump out of the way when he was hitting me. Uh. Damn it. I need to use my gun to fucking build up. Fucking my demon meter. Fuck, why can't I fucking escape it? Fuck you, motherfucker! Fuck you! Fuck you! You... You fucking suck! Fuck you! Dude. The guns suck in this game. Holy shit, that sucked ass. Rachnophobia, cool. That took me one fucking hour. Just to do him. It says I did it in 12 minutes, but no, I had to go. <laughs> Fuck you, dude. Just, I'm just glad I'm done. I'm gonna leave the video here. I hope you guys did enjoy it. I hope you guys did enjoy my suffering. I hope you guys do enjoy the rest of the series. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!